After a battle with cancer in 2016, myself, Jason, Lorraine, our daughter, Little Miss P, we sold all of our stuff and left Los Angeles to start a small one and a half acre homestead. With no farming background, we wanted to figure out how to grow our own food and live as healthy as possible and to just live a happy life as a family. Today is Thanksgiving. We got up super early today because we needed to cook or we're gonna smoke that turkey. We got a 12 pound turkey that we got from our friends uh, Justin and Rebecca Rhodes from earlier in the year when we helped them butcher their turkeys and their chickens. In over four years that we've been here, we've never had family visit us or be here for Thanksgiving. And so this year is the first year we're gonna have Lorraine's parents over because they're moved to the area. So uh, they're coming over and we're gonna have a Thanksgiving dinner. Typically we would maybe go over a friend's house or usually it's just us here and it's just like a normal day uh, just hanging out and cooking good food. Apple cider vinegar and some water just to give it a little spritz. What are you doing, Penelope? Uh, I'm the ironing a tablecloth. What's the tablecloth for? Thanksgiving. We're gonna put it on the freezer because we're gonna have tons of food. Mom, what are you doing? Washing all the dishes. <laughs> Washing dishes. So we're looking at 165 here. Is the temp we need it to be? Ooh, it's hot in here. It's like 120 degrees in here. this up with water so the chicken won't or the turkey won't dry out so you have to fill this up periodically as as this turkey's going popcorn sprouts i am making a salad from all of the ingredients almost all the ingredients from casey and tori's honey tree farm it's gonna be good What's that called? Kohlrabi. Oh, can I have some? Yes, I will peel one for you and and Papa and Grandma to share. Is that table movable? Kind of like a radish. Yeah, it's like a, a sweet radish. A sweet radish. Fill up chicken feed. Mm. 
Trying not to do too much today, actually. I'm trying to keep it easy, but it's hard, man. It's it's hard for me to take it easy. Like, I want to do a bunch of things. I'm always up. I can never sit down. Bernice. Happy Thanksgiving, Bernice. It's taking a little bit longer in the smoker than what we had planned for. So we're just gonna finish it off in the oven just to kind of get it like maybe three degrees higher. <laughs> Internal temperature. I don't know why I put that one so short. <laughs> Where's? Right are those the ones you made, Penelope? Yeah. Yeah, let me, I'm Where gonna are check they? the temperature of They're, that. um, mm. dinner rolls. Are they, they gluten-free dinner rolls? Yeah. All right, my favorite. So the internal temperature needs to be 165? Yeah. So that, that's what we're having trouble here. This turkey has been smoking for over nine hours. And for whatever reason, it's not heating up inside. Uh, almost there, it's at 160, so that's why we put it in the oven. I know, that's the problem. This turkey's too fresh over here. We called Justin. <laughs> Your turkey's too fresh. <laughs> we calculated the time, okay. unless... All right, turkey's done. How's that look, Penelope? Good. You ready to eat? Yeah. All right. Are you supposed to lock it in with this? Oh, where's the gravy? The what? Right here. Right here. So we got lettuce. What is this? That is a sweet potato. Okay, so we got salad, fresh salad. Sweet potato casserole, cranberry sauce, homemade cranberry sauce, stuffing, gluten-free stuffing. We've got a turkey, this einkorn bread roll, and these are like so fluffy and so soft. They're like pillows. Mm -hmm. uh, and then mashed potatoes and gravy, and then there's hidden uh, steamed green beans with lemon zest. And then for dessert, pumpkin pie. More treats. 